So I'm starting with my chicken cordon bleu. This is a recipe that goes way, way back. But what I love about it is that it's easy to make and the kids love it. So Jade is gonna be so happy. So we're just gonna season some chicken breasts with a little bit of salt. Then I want to put a little bit of olive oil in the pan and we're gonna start cooking the chicken. Start searing the chicken. I make this regularly. It's one of my go-to dishes. But it's funny because it's only in the last like few months that I've started really making this a lot. Before that, I think it was a little too complex for Jade, so she wasn't really into it. But now, she's gotten older, and it's all about chicken cordon bleu. So we're gonna make like a little cream sauce to go between the ham layer and the cheese layer. What we're gonna do is we're gonna add two tablespoons of mascarpone. And then we're gonna add a little bit of Dijon grain mustard. It's sort of that little bit of a blend that works really well together and it gives it lots of flavor. Jade's getting older, it's like a little bit more of an adult palate. So three tablespoons of the grainy Dijon and we'll mix it together. Mix this together and it gets nice and creamy. It also keeps the chicken nice and moist and gives it lots of flavor. Okay, we're done with that. Now, let's take a look at our chicken. And you don't have to worry too much about cooking the chicken through because we're gonna cook it under the broiler as well. So it definitely gets cooked up. So now, we take a half a piece of Swiss cheese, and traditionally it's made with Swiss cheese and ham and we put it on every slice of chicken. Then on top of the Swiss cheese, we put ham. So a slice of ham, whatever kind of ham you like. Like sometimes I use provolone cheese instead of Swiss cheese, and you can use uh, black forest ham or honey baked ham, any kind of ham you like. And then we do a little bit of the mascarpone and mustard mixture on top of every slice, just like that. And I think too what's fun is because Jade and her friends are coming from volleyball, they get really hungry. So I think this is really a nice meal. It's a little more elegant and also very hearty. Okay, so we've got that. And last, another half a slice of the cheese right on top. And now we're gonna pop it under the broiler, let the cheese melt and finish cooking the chicken for a couple of minutes, and then it's ready to eat. <laughs>